All right, this is to help you with um, a question that is on your project. Okay, it says in a stained glass pattern, angle one is congruent to angle two. Um, so they appear that way. I'm going to go ahead and mark them. So congruent means they are the same size. So I've now marked angle one and angle two. Whatever they are, they are the same. Angle one and angle three are complementary. Now I can see that angle one and angle three are complementary because you see they form a right angle together. So together they are 90 degrees. Angle two and angle four are also complementary. Again, we can see that in the drawing that they make a 90 degree angle together. If the measure of angle one is 28.6, I'm going to go ahead and put that in. Angle one is 28.6. I'm also going to make angle 2 28.6 because in the information I was told those are congruent. They're exactly the same size. What is the measure of angle 4 then? Well, given our information, um, if angle 2 and angle 4 are complementary, which is what they told us, and also what we can see from the drawing, that they make a 90 degree angle. So angle 4, whatever its measure is, plus the 28.6 that we know is the major in angle 2. Together, those are 90. We're going to go ahead and solve from there. Just going to subtract 28.6 from both sides, and I'll find out, well, what do you have to add to 28.6 to get 90? And it looks like it's 61.4. So the measure of angle 4 would be 61.4. Um, interestingly enough, that would also be the measure of angle 3.